Heli are ions of group 7, ion of halogen. For example, chloride, bromide, and iodide are halogen. Now we know that this test tube do contain heli for the first one. We're going to add some bromide. For the second one, we're going to add some sodium chloride. We add a bit of water so we can make a solution. As we do so, then white powder dissolve might need to shake it a bit. As you can see, it has separated the positive sodium ion from the chloride ion so make them free to move around. For the third one, we add some potassium iodide. Silver halide are soluble. So its presence of an halide can be shown up by adding silver ion, and if an soluble product it from that show up the fact that halide was present. We're going to make that visible by adding silver ion to show up the fact of this halide R. So we're going to add some silver nitrate to the first one. We can see green color solution from. This means the bromide is present and add silver nitrate to the second one which is chloride it form a white color precipitate this must be silver chloride this tells us the chloride was present at the start and for the third one add some silver nitrate to the potassium iodide when we add silver nitrate to the last solution we see it turn yellow form and we can infer that yellow silver iodide form so there must have been an iodide present there. some equipment that is needed to test for opposite ion solution. Prepare 6 test tubes. Sodium hydroxide, ion 2 nitrate, ion 3 nitrate, copper 2 sulfate, calcium chloride, magnesium sulfate, aluminium sulfate. First step, we are going to add sodium hydroxide to each test tube. We are going to add iron 2 nitrate on the first test tube. To see the results, add green precipitate. Next, adding iron 3 nitrate on the second test tube. We will get orange brown precipitate. Then, adding calcium chloride to get white precipitate. Adding magnesium sulfate to test two. We will get white precipitate. Then adding copper to sulfate to make test two. As you see, blue precipitate will form. After that, add aluminium sulfate to the last test two. The result is a white precipitate.
Do you want to know?